From today, I am going to tell you everything there is to know about which narratives and ecosystems will pump. The traditional cycle of Bitcoin pumping and money flowing over from Bitcoin to the top 10 altcoins and further down to the smaller market caps is flawed. In my vision, Bitcoin will pump first. And after the Bitcoin pump, the money will flow to one of the narrative like AI, which will pump sky high. And after this narrative, the professionals will take out their profits and the next narrative will pump and so on. So the money flow will from narrative to narrative, and it's important to catch the first wave on the first narrative to grab your gains, and to hop over the next pumping narrative to catch the next wave of profits. Okay, let's go. What's happening today? Bitcoin is stabilizing at $76,428, with massive positive ETF inflows of more than $1.3 billion yesterday. Ethereum is up 2.7% today, continuing its upward trend this week of 16.2%. Also for Ethereum positive net inflows of $79 million yesterday. Fear and greed change from extreme greed to greed today. This is a positive signal for a further rally. Bitcoin dominance creeping up to 60%, signaling an increased chance of a beginning of the altcoin season. Top 10 crypto are up plus 1.3% on average, with Cardano up 14% today leading the pack. Which narratives and ecosystems are booming and crashing? At this moment, the only ecosystem in the green is the Tungcoin ecosystem, with a plus of 4.3%, thanks to a 72% price explosion of the Empire Project. The decentralized finance narrative was performing very well today. On average, the narrative is down 1.8% with positive injective and ORCA as positive exceptions with gains of 4 and 8% today. The Web3 narrative's average is hoovering around 0%, with Helium Mobile leading the charge, with an impressive plus of almost 15%. That's it for today. Follow me, and I'll see you tomorrow, same time, same place. Cheers!